How do you know if the itch down there is a yeast infection or herpes? So yeast infections and genital herpes are two very different conditions, but they have a number of symptoms that overlap. So let's talk about the difference between a yeast infection and genital herpes. A yeast infection is a vaginal infection caused by an overgrowth of candida, which is a type of fungi. It is not an STI, and the treatment usually involves antifungals and in some cases, boric acid. Typically, there's no smell with a yeast infection. You'll have white cottage cheese-like discharge. You may experience some pain during sex or while peeing. You'll likely have itching. Um, sometimes there will be a red scaly rash, and occasionally you can get yeast infections in recurrent episodes or something called chronic yeast infections. Genital herpes is an STI that's caused by the herpes simplex virus. There are two virus strains that can cause genital herpes, HSV-1 and HSV-2, and these are the same viruses that cause oral herpes, which are also known as cold sores. Genital herpes typically causes recurrent episodes, but um, treatment like antivirals can help minimize this. Like a yeast infection, there typically isn't a smell, and you will have itchiness as well as sometimes pain during sex or while peeing. Vaginal discharge will be either thin and watery or normal. Sort of the typical symptom of genital herpes is red bumps or blisters on the skin, which usually you don't get with a yeast infection, along with wounds or ulcers. The other difference is that sometimes you'll have a fever or swollen glands with genital herpes.